Hello friends, welcome back to another video. In this video, I will be providing you the solution of our skill batch of the day. Yes, the monsoon season is started and the arcade with this is also kicked out. Under this season from 22nd July to 31st of the July, for every one skill batch, you will be rewarded with one arcade point. Yes, on completing one skill batch, which looks like this, you will be getting one arcade point. And again, these arcade points are required to claim your free Google goodies and swags. Yes, okay. So let's just deep dive into it click on the start button i will be providing you the solution of every challenge lab this skill batch contain so as you can see there are total four labs or actually five labs under this uh, challenge so we have to complete all these five labs to get this skill batch and today i will be providing you the solution of this first lab in this video the rest uh, solution of these labs would be coming up within uh, as soon as possible actually i will provide you the solution as soon as possible in this video we will be solving this lab so click on this lab and open it uh, uh, click on the creating a virtual machine lab it will redirect you to this page and as you can see one credit is required to complete this lab and uh, if you don't have credit then you can't start this lab so make sure you have your monthly subscription in your account if you don't have the monthly subscription till yet then simply check this video of my youtube channel the link is in the description also you will get your two month free subscription immediately okay so simply come back to the lab click on the start lab button and uh, you will get your credentials simply right click upon open google cloud console and open it in incognito mode it's important to open it in incognito window email id will be automatically pasted up click on the next button email id apne aap paste ho aegi simply come back to here copy this password come here paste the password here hit enter button wait for it to load click on i understand button and now you are logged in into your google cloud click uh, skill boost profile okay now you uh, here you have to uh, accept a uh, certain terms and condition so click on checkbox and click on agree and continue now you are good to go first of all what you need to do simply click on this compute engine button on the left corner click on this compute engine button it will start your compute engine and on this corner this activate cloud shell button click on this activate cloud shell button cut this you get loaded Click on the continue button, minimize it, you can minimize it for now and click on create new instance. We have to create new instance because it's given in the task number one. We have to create a new instance from the cloud console. Okay, so these are the details we have to fill for the instance. So copy this name very carefully for your instance. Copy it, come back to the lab, paste it under this instance section, name section. Remove this and paste a new name and uh, select the region and zone given in the lab. So for the region, it must be US East 4 and zone would be EUS East 4 B. Okay. So come here. It's already selected as US East 4. So for the zone, select US East 4 B. Select whatever zone given in your lab. Okay. So make sure your lab have a certain region and the zone and select your given uh, region and the zone. Okay. Jo bhi aapki lab mein given ho. वो आपको सेलेक्ट करना है मेरा वाला सेलेक्ट करना नहीं है अगर सेम है तो कोई बात नहीं अदरवाइज यू हैव टू सेलेक्ट योर रीजन एंड जोन ओके आफ्टर दैट द सीरीज विल बी E2 मशीन टाइप वुड बी टू वर्चुअल सीपीयू एंड द लिनक्स वर्जन वुड बी Debian GNX GNU Linux 11 सो लेट्स सेट द चेंजिंग्स लेट मेक द चेंजेस हियर द मशीन इज E2 ओके इट्स E2 मीडियम स्टैंडर्ड and it's Debian 11. So we have to change it to the, uh, it's uh, selected as the uh, 12. We have to change it to the 11. So change it, click on this, select the 11 and click on the select button. Okay, select this one, try it. Yes, select the uh, GNU Linux 11. If in your case it's already 11, then don't worry. But if it's uh, other than the mentioned one, then select it to the 11. Okay. Uh, scroll, scroll down. You have to select this allow HTTPS traffic because it's given here. We have to allow the HTTP traffic. Now click on the create button. Okay. So simply come here, click on the create button and wait for your virtual instance to be created. Okay. So it will take some time. Once uh, the virtual machine would be created, you will get a green tick here. So wait for around four to five minutes. After that, we will progress in the video and we will complete the remaining task. So it's simply sit back and relax. And in that time, make sure you hit the subscribe button and hit the like button. Okay. So we will come back to our instance create. When we get a green tick, we will come back to the video. Okay.
So as you, as you can see, our instance is created, status is green tick. Now what you have to do, simply click on this connect uh, on this uh, arrow button under the SSH tab because in the next task, task two, we have to install the GNX server or NGINX web server. And for that, we have to connect with the SSH certificate or the shell. So simply click on this and click on uh, UG cloud command and uh, click on run in cloud shell. Okay, it will automatically open this uh, tab that we activated from this top button cloud shell button. So now what you need to do hit enter button. Make sure this command will be automatically pasted. Okay, click on authorize button. Wait for this click on the uh, keyboard and Y button. Okay. It is asking for do you want to continue to so from the keyboard we have to press Y capital Y and hit enter. And uh, again, it will asking you for the uh, empty phrases or the enter pass phrase. Hit enter button here. You don't need to type anything. Simply hit enter. Again, hit enter button. Okay. And uh, again, hit enter and wait for it to load. It will take a couple of seconds. You can see it's loaded. Now what you have to do, simply come back to here. Copy this first command under the task number two. We have to update the OS, paste it here and hit enter button sudo apt get update command is generally used for the update get, fetch the updates and if you already done the system command training then you have to be aware of this okay now simply come back to here copy the second command paste it here hit enter button wait for it to run until that simply come back to here is the next command wait for this command to run properly and uh, how you can check that the command is run you will see a dollar sign at the end it means your command is run and you are good to go to run the next command okay so aapko kya karna hai? simply paste the command that we just copied and hit enter button okay so with this we are done with the uh, task number two what we have to do scroll down click on check my progress and you will get the green tick in the uh, task number two we can see assessment is completed make sure you get the green tick it's very required okay now scroll down we have to create a new instance again so scroll down copy this command copy the first command come back to the lab now click on this plus icon we have to open a new tab and uh, wait for it to establish the connection after that paste the command that we just copied and hit enter button and it will initialize the instance that we just created uh, just wait for a second what happened so we get an error maybe that's because we didn't uh, update the zone here so let's try it also so simply copy it once again in the cloud shell use your g cloud to create a new vm instance from the command line so copy this to check your progress okay so let's try once again copy this command come back to here paste it here and now this time instead of this dollar zone what we will do we will come to here and we will copy this zone copy the zone given into your lab okay now paste it here and try once again yes it is start it seems to be started wait for the couple of seconds for the process to be done once this process will be done we will be done with the lab also okay so wait for a couple of seconds for the process to be done here it's started and it's completed you have got the shell uh, once again live so what you have to do you are done with this lab simply scroll down click on the check my progress you get the green tick you can see assessment completed and uh, also click on this and uh, get all the 100 score you can see we get the 50 out of 50 points in both the tasks we got the green tick for all the tasks now we are good to go we can simply end the lab because uh, we get the green tick for all the assessments okay don't need to get the green ticks on this we don't need to complete this congratulations your comp uh, lab is completed we can click on the end lab button record the end lab button once again give the star rating that you want to give also you can leave any additional comment if you want and click on submit button come back to the main page click on this main menu or the actually yes click on this button scroll down and you can see we get the green tick beside our lab. It means we successfully completed this lab. In the same manner, we would be completing all the rest remaining four labs. And once we completed with all the five labs, we will get this skill batch, which is worth one arcade point. In the similar manner, I would be uploading the solution of every challenges. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. And if you like the video, make sure you hit the like button. And if you have any query, you can ask me in the comment box. That's it. Thank you very much. Good. Bye.